Hey everybody, this is Phil with ebooktemplates101.com and Authors Insider Club. And in today's video, I'm going to answer a question that I get asked quite a bit. And that question is, how do I go in and make changes to a book I've already published on the Kindle? So let's jump right into it and show you how to do that. So let's say you publish your book on the Kindle and then you've discovered there's a bunch of spelling errors or, you know, something doesn't look right or maybe you want to add something to your book or change it in some way, you can go back in and do that without having to publish a brand new book and delete the one that's on there. So let me show you how to do that. The first thing you want to do is log in to Kindle Direct Publishing. You go to kdp.amazon.com and log in and go to your dashboard. On your dashboard, you'll see a list of books that you've published on the Kindle. And what you want to do is just hit a check mark, you know, do a check mark in the box for the title that you want to upload the new file for. So I'll go ahead and do that for this one. This is just a sample one here. Once you put a check mark in there, just click on Actions, which is up here, and then click on Edit Book Details. And that takes you to this screen here. So there's a couple different things you can do. Um, the two main things that most people like to change are either the cover or the book file itself. So if you want to change the cover, just browse for your new cover image and upload that just by clicking on that button there. And that'll upload your new book cover. So that's if you want to change the book cover. If you want to actually change your book file, so if you're correcting something that's in there or you're adding content or removing content or whatever, you need to upload a brand new book file. So all you have to do is just click, click on Browse right here and upload your new book file to Amazon. Now, the change is not immediate. When you re-upload a new book file, your current version still stays on sale, so it's not going to mess up your sales. It's still going to be up. And the new version that you've uploaded will take anywhere from 24 to 48 hours to actually switch over. So... In about 48 hours, usually at the most, your new version will be the one that people get when they buy your book. So don't worry if it does take a day or two to actually switch over to the new version. So that's really all there is to it. It's really simple to do, to edit and make changes to books you've already published. Now there is one other thing you need to do if you've made like significant changes and you want people who have already bought and downloaded your book to get the new version, then what you want to do is come down here where it says contact us at uh, the kdp.amazon.com site and you want to send them a message that you've changed your book and that you want everybody who's purchased and downloaded your book to get the new version. So you will have to um, ask Amazon to do that for you and they're going to ask you to show them what you've changed and they'll determine if you've made enough changes that are significant enough to actually send the new version to previous purchasers. So that's all there is to it. If you have any questions or ideas for more videos on self-publishing, let me know. And if not, we'll see you in the next video.